The hydraulic torque converter has the ability to transfer power with torque amplification and its maximum efficiency is obtained around the half of the rotation speed of its input shaft speed. For this reason, overall speed range of vehicles cannot be operated by a single converter. When the converter is operated at the low efficiency speed range, a heating value becomes larger and the converter becomes larger and heavier. To avoid this, gears with a different reduction ratio must be used according to the vehicle speed. One method is to attach multiple hydraulic converters, coupled with different reduction ratio gears. Another is to attach the multi-speed mechanical transmission after a single hydraulic converter. The latter is lighter than the former, but the sophisticated control system to change gears is required to avoid the breakage due to a shock. German had these technologies available in practical use since before. This picture illustrates the basic component of Mekhydro transmission. The left end engine is coupled with the step up gear. The force is transferred to the hydraulic converter. The output of the hydraulic converter rotates the first gear of the gearbox. The next gear reduces the rotational speed and increases the torque. The next gear is rotated through the claw clutch. This paired claw clutch system is called Maibaha Deflector Claw. Plural pairs of these devices can build up the multi-stage speed change transmission. This animation shows the connection state of the first stage of this transmission. Red colored parts indicates the path of force to drive. Next is the second stage. Then third stage. And fourth stage. This schema shows the tractive effort for each shift gear stage. The hydraulic converter amplifies the torque and compensates the flat torque characteristics of diesel engines that is not suitable for vehicle drives. The first stage produces the high tractive effort, but the available speed range is narrow. By shifting up the gear stage, the wide speed range with a reasonable efficiency is achieved. When coupling the claw clutch, the rotational speed of each shaft must be adjusted properly. To complement this, the braking device is equipped within the converter to interrupt the oil flow and to speed down the rotational speed of the shaft quickly. Disadvantages of this system are the interruption of the tractive force and the shift shock while changing gears. Advantages are its lightweight, little oil deterioration in the sealed container and high temperature operation. This system was adopted mainly in Europe, Germany. In Japan, one prototype locomotive was produced and tested later.